Hey guys, Fish in Australia here. Today I'm down on the east coast of Tassie on the beach. Got the big surf rod and the little rod. Full moon. Got the eel on the rods. Two hooks and the little rod. Casting out in this deep hole. Hoping to pull out some mullet and salmon on this rod. Maybe in a, even a flatty and a big shut gummy on this rod. So, yep, we'll get right to it. And we'll see you guys when we've got on a fish. That's a fish. That's gotta be a fish. I'm 90% sure that's a fish. There he is. There's the first fish. Little Aussie salmon. Slammed it as soon as I hit the water. I was going to release this guy, but he completely swallowed it, so he's going to be bait. I'll go over this rod that's been getting bites non-stop. And now we're on. Not a bad fish. Up he comes, it's uh, another salmon. So, got the other one for bait, so won't be needing bait anytime soon. So, good sight in that video, just right here. Bites on big rod, looks like it's on the top piece, so big salmon or shark. And then there's that little salmon, which is gone now. Off he goes. Oh, uh, come on, go, wrong way. Yes, there you go. Fish on. Another fish on on the little rod. Not a bad one too. Is that a mullet? Yeah, that's a nice sized mullet. So there he is. Not a bad size mullet. And back he goes. Yep. Knew I was on. I was just putting out the surf rod. I put my baits down a bit because I've had heaps of bites, but just none of hooked. So, oh, I don't have a fish. Oh, well that's a first. <laughs> so yeah, smaller bait, got a bit of salmon on now. So, smaller bait, small hook coming out of the boat should mean better chance of hookup. So, time to go off, Big Rod. <laughs> we're on, we're on, we're on, we're on, we're on, we're on, we're on. You guys probably can't see much, but I'm pretty sure you could hear that. Look at him go. Oh.
Pump and wind. Let's go. That full moon over there has put me onto this bad boy here. Now he's giving in a bit. Oh, he's back. Come on, be a gummy. He hasn't like stuck to the floor yet. So I think he might be a gummy. He's coming in pretty easy now. Oh, pump and wind. Oh, that was big. He's at the bank. I'm bringing him up now. It's a shark. It's a gummy. There he is. The gummy. You probably can't see him at all. But there he is. He is size easy. We'll grab the better torch so you can have a better look. So they've got to be 75 centimeters. He is easily the required 70. Caught on the eel. The eel from the tamer. There he is. The big boy. You. I'm not sure if you can see that rat. And you probably can't understand English with a torch, but that is a gummy. Oh, yes. It's my first gummy off the surf. So they're called a gummy because inside that mouth there, there's no teeth. There's just, just gums. So there he is. Get back out and get another. Got a measurement on him with the rod. I'll put it back on. I'll put it on the video now. Anyway, oh, spat out me holders. Can I just hold you, please? Don't fail me now, rod holders. There we go. Rod holders are in. On the scale. We'll see how bad this boy. There it is. So, put it up there. And he's about nine pounds, four and a half kilos. Nice sized fish. So, gummy them. And it's important that when you catch one, you bleed it out by cutting off the tail. So just cut the tail right off, let him bleed out, and that gets rid of the mercury in them. So, yeah, so good catch, and hopefully we'll get another. So guys, that's it. Thanks for watching this short and probably very weird video, how like it went from catching salmon late at night to a gummy shark 
but oh well um leaving just on the one gummy shark got my feed with him so pretty happy so yeah caught on the eel that me and Farquhar caught in the Tamar uh, last week. So there's the chunks of it now. Another one up there. So yeah, anyway, we'll um, stop the video and see you guys next time. And now I gotta walk up that bloody hill with all this gear, yay. <laughs> Thanks for watching, please like, share and subscribe. See you guys next time.